I don't see any evidence of that happening for probably hundreds of years in, with artificial intelligence.在众多领域转型出广阔应用前景的当下，人工智能无疑已经成为众多行业巨头竞相追逐的时代宠儿。本期Box说，我们有幸在2016年世界机器人大会期间，独家专访了著名机器人制造专家、美国国家工程院院士
Well, I think um, w when they're very young in, in high school, learning how to write computer code is the first step, I think. And it can be fun, too. I really think it's fun. <laughs> and then uh, once they go to uh, university uh, to study courses in machine learning, artificial intelligence, um, I, I think we are going to see a great need for more and more people with those skills over the next few years. Well, I think one mistake many people make is they get in love with the technology, but really they have to find something that is providing value to people, because otherwise there won't be customers in the end. So they have to think through how what they find exciting is something that's going to be valuable to a customer, so the customer will want whatever system or product they build. In the last 50 years, we've gone from computers being something that are in special rooms to computers being on our bodies. We have them everywhere. And I think we'll get robotic technology everywhere around us. You know, in, in, in 50 years, every, every light fixture, every door, every part of our home will be robotic in some way.